do you think with the advent of ai and all ai automation in sub ke zamane mein like do you think manual trading will be a lost art see it's no longer ai versus humans anymore it's going to be ai versus humans using ai so like try to visualize a fight between iron man and terminator okay so terminator is like this perfectly coded machine whereas iron man is this uh, flawed individual who is supercharged with technology now 7 out of 10 times iron man will beat terminator why because you know he can adapt and he, you know he can uh, strategize you know while fighting so us cheez ka bahut ek advantage milta hai when there's a human behind it to so, market mein bhi aisi hai ki market ki jo regimes hain they are not linear so you need to continuously adapt yourself and a machine cannot you know which is like a hard coded thing wo us hisab se improvise nahi kar sakti so i have kind of an extreme opinion on this because um, you know market is a collective mechanism of human emotions in the end matlab chahe kitne bhi uh, automation aa jaye chahe kitne bhi data crunching uh, tools aa jaye chahe kitne bhi ai aa jaye in the end it's people's money on the line so when everybody starts using ai and when everybody starts using automation then wahan pe ek cluttering aa jati hai and everybody starts behaving the same way so in my opinion this is my personal opinion of course in my opinion going forward i would say that discretionary trading Uh, or the human edge is only going to get pronounced because abhi aap dekh sakte hai ki like a uh, couple of weeks back we got this news ki d shaw which has been predominantly an algo kind of a player so for the first time they have raised probably like 5 or 6 billion dollars for a human only fund so they are also seeing that okay now probably the tides might shift because till this point it's always about the data and systematic trading and number crunching and kind of you know extrapolating whatever has happened in the past will happen in the future kind of that kind of a trading but going forward when data is being accessible to everybody when technology and execution is accessible to everybody then probably the markets will kind of clutter on that part and probably the human edge wo jo markets ka sentiments jo analyze kar sakta hai jo apne emotions ko control kar sakta hai that is going to trump going forward that's what i feel so this is a very interesting uh, thing that i have been thinking about when we talk about ai into markets we basically talking about adaptivity of uh, what the data is coming and the speed of it right so i have a slightly different opinion about it i think on the faster time frame like a very hft time where you are taking decisions within a seconds or all i do believe uh, already a lot of trades are generated by adaptive models jahan pe algorithm is adaptive enough to be called an ai or an ml program uh, where it is taking trades by itself depending on what the data is coming i think it is already happening a lot in the higher hft space or very fast space when we talk about slower trades where the trades are being taken at 5 minutes or higher let's say day or even a month there is no inherent edge of uh, deciphering the trade faster by an ai or a human so a lot of the times a human takes a better sense of the market uh, than what an ai does and then makes a better decisions this is for now the thing with tech is tech evolves really at a fast pace and goes exponential it happens really fast like like with all this uh, chat gpt and other models that we have seen it it just blew up instantly and could do things that we didn't think it could do right so uh, i am open to the fact that yes a market could be taken up by ml programs really fast and we would not see it coming but uh, th- then again we are making a future ball shot we don't know when it happens it will happen one day it's not now so at least uh, i think our generation will not have a problem with uh, ai or ml taking over them it, it could change really fast our lifespan for an ai is few milliseconds <laughs> for us is like many many years right the data we do i want to ask this to sarang because sarang has seen trading for over more than two decades now so aapke is journey mein there has been a lot of technological advancements for example pehle matlab jo log manual jobbing ke through people used to trade arbitrage then that stopped existing and then came python based scripts and then came automation then based api based trading sab aapne dekha hai but even now you are still a manual trader so is there a particular reason behind that or is it just the resistance to change see you yourself are also like you know trading manually only and uh, discretionary trading karte ho to see again beech beech mein aisa time aata hai like uh, you know when algo trading was like the thing but wo ab jo uska ek advantage tha wo ab nahi dikhta i mean i can see now that you know the more time you have and the you know more discretion you try that is going to be an edge going forward 
तो इतने सालों से जो मैंने देखा है वी आर स्टिल डूइंग द सेम काइंड ऑफ ट्रेडिंग एंड वी आर डूइंग लाइक फाइन आई मीन वी आर सर्वाइविंग द मार्केट एंड ऑल काइंड ऑफ रिजीम वी हैव सीन तो आई डोंट सी एनी यू नो थिंग्स चेंजिंग इन द फ्यूचर एज वेल I think Nikhil has something else to say. Yeah, so why uh, what I was trying to say is uh, it's a progressive kind of a tool. Abhi tak its ka ML and all programs are very focused towards the very fast trades. That's where the space. That's where they are competing with each other with data. Basically, human mind cannot visualize data as fast as possible. For the for me to actually go click a mouse, take a trade. An HFT can take thousands and thousands of trade within that one second, where I come and go and execute a trade, right? So that is where an ML program, right now, right now, at the current moment of time, an ML program or AI is actually being used to be trading. Uh, retail space, me, our space, me, abhi tak to nahi hai because we are trading slightly slower time frame and we have enough uh, mental bandwidth to actually make decisions right now. Depending on how competitive it get, uh, we will we will know with the future only. It's very hard to say. But I am on the tech side. That sooner or later, uh, the tech will take over uh, inherently. As uh, Sarang said rightly, that it will always be the human behind who is doing that, basically building that tech. But uh, there would be a lot of automation and adaptive nature in that tech that the tech starts take, making its own decision. That's what AI is. So it will happen. I mean, I kind of agree to that partially because the lower and lower time frames that you go into. of course the tech will have an upper hand because humans have their own capability limitations but as you move away from hft space and as you come into mft space or as you come into probably you know even positional and swing trading space i think a human would have a better judgment of uh, you know getting a 360 view of the markets and a human is at any point is adaptive much faster adaptability hai rehta hai human ke paas and he'll have an overall sense of the market and not just like a one dimensional thing so i would feel that yes smaller time frames pe tech will have a better edge but as you move away from hft and into the mft space or into the positional space or even into the investing space probably human edge i don't think it's go, it's going to go anywhere no so the thing with uh, when we talk about uh, mft or uh, or a lower positional monthly daily kind of a time frame then you have to understand that all the data analysis the basic work is when we are talking about ai versus humans doing work we are basically talking about data analysis execution is not a big of a challenge when you are taking monthly trades or a hourly trades or even daily trade, whatever time frame trades like slower trend execution का इतना मैटर नहीं करेगा वेन यू आर डूइंग एज अ ह्यूमन और थिंक इट्स मोस्टली अबाउट डेटा एनालिसिस हाउ मच अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा यू कैन क्रंच इन योर हेड एंड इन योर बाय अ कोड राइट सो द अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा दैट वी हैव नाउ वॉस इज द अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा दैट वी हैव ट्वेंटी ईयर्स हैज सिग्निफिकेंटली चेंज कितना एक्सेस होता था कितना अवेलेबल होता था एंड ऑल अब तो रिटेल के पास इतना डेटा है दैट वी डोंट नो सो 915 गिव्स अस सो मच डेटा दैट वी डिडंट हैव 4 इयर्स बैक राइट वी कुड नॉट लुक इनटू इट वी मी एंड सारंग यूज्ड टू मैन्युअली जॉट इट डाउन ऑन एक्सेल एंड देन डू इट सो ऑल दोस वर्क हैज स्लाइटली ऑटोमेटेड बाय प्लेटफॉर्म्स लाइक 915 राइट सो आई डू थिंक कि उस स्पेस में इतना इशू नहीं आएगा बिकॉज़ देयर इज नो इनहेरेंट एज ऑफ एग्जीक्यूटिंग फास्टर but a smaller space uh, faster space is come i i can foresee it gone within within very fast uh, period but usme bhi aisa hai na ki you need to be the fastest there i mean jiske paas sabse fast car hogi wohi he will the one, be the one who will win correct so i feel that i feel that the margins are gonna you know get smaller and smaller it's like f1 correct so the difference between somebody who scores a pole position versus somebody who comes in 10th or 12th it's like a 1000th of a second and that has progressed over let's say 15 years of tech innovation that happened in that space so similarly wo jo uh, wo jo edge jo hota hai wo thin hota hota jata hai and the margin becomes very small and where probably you know it might not be viable for the players to actually compete there unless you are actually like you know law having a lot of resources at your disposal also uh, there i have it's it's not the first time that people are thinking about it a lot of people have actually built a lower time frame or medium time frame ai programs and reddit reddit if you go on reddit bhara pada hai with the stories about there so none of them has successfully uh, cracked it uh, there are trades taken by like if you build a if you spend some time couple of weeks and all build a uh, let's say build a program through chat gpt or something it will lose you a crazy amount of money it is not going to make you money so there are comp- there are like crazy amount of uh, uh, stories works on reddit uh, to be talked uh, to be seen where people are trying to use uh, 
एन ए आई टू ट्रेड लोअर टाइम फ्रेम प्रोडक्ट लाइक कि डेली वीकली आरली पे दे आर नॉट बिन परफॉर्मिंग वेल एज ऑफ नाउ इट कुड चेंज वे टाइम बट अभी तक तो नहीं है सो इट्स अ फन स्पेस टू लुक एट बट टेक इज वेरी फास्ट इन ग्रोथ ए आई तो अभी यू कैन सी विद द वीडियो जनरेशन की जो साल भर पहले था जो अब है उसमें बहुत फर्क है तो हु नोज वर्ड्स इन स्टोर I mean, Max Verstappen, who is, and the other guy, who is Red Bull, who is, who like Max is the one who is always winning with the same car. So, that's the same. I mean, that human edge, which is always there, is always there with the machine. So, that edge is not going to go anytime soon. And uh, fully automation is something which I don't think is going to have that edge. Absolutely. Also, with this space, uh, when we talk about AI, I think it will be one guy eats all the pie. there would like with every space it is happening wherever ai is uh, taking a, uh, away it will be ki yaar ek uh, uh, there will be one uh, big uh, basically breakthrough in the space that that guy takes all the space all all of it in one go uh, we uh, had it with jane street ha- taking it over here it's not with ai but probably something we don't know but with ai specifically it happens a lot that one one particular company one particular entity one particular person will take it all over through with his big breakthrough in uh, whatever he does investment in securities market are subject to market risks read all the related documents carefully before investing please read the risk disclosure documents carefully before investing in equity shares derivatives mutual fund and all other instruments traded on the stock exchanges